am Brianne Burnell, a mixed media artist making layered abstract art full of dreamy colors and textures. My art form is mixed media collage. My pieces are layers and layers of collaged, torn, hand-painted paper mixed with any kind of art material. I love working with house paint. I love oil pastel, pencil crayons, really anything I can get my hands on. And I try all different techniques. I do something called experimental mark making, which is using all different tools and all different methods to create unique marks in abstract art. For me, the process of creating the artwork is the point. So I don't approach it with an idea in mind of what it's gonna look like when I'm finished. I simply build and layer and piece together and explore and I watch it come together. It's an extremely intuitive process and that is where the magic happens. The thing that inspires me the most is the actual process of making the art. The colors, the textures, the tools, the materials. I want to know how every single color looks beside every single other color. I want to know how I can manipulate fabric to create all different textures, or what happens when you layer a fabric with a coffee filter, or what tools I can buy at the dollar store to turn into art tools and create unexpected, unique marks that I've never seen before. And I'm not in control of it. It's like magic. My signature style involves a distinct color palette with a lot of blue, purple, pink, and the torn paper textures. There's definitely something unique in how I put the art together that makes it recognizable to people. And there's always this uplifting quality in the work. It makes you feel good. And I think that's because when I'm making the art, that's what I'm trying to do for myself. I express my creativity by following all of my creative whims and trying even my wildest ideas without worrying about what anyone else thinks of them. I've been creating art my entire life ever since I was a little kid and I began working as an artist professionally in 2013 when I very impulsively quit my job to become an artist. So I rented a little studio space, 35 square feet, and I started collaging and as soon as I started collaging something lit up in my brain and I've never looked back. It's almost impossible for me to imagine what my life would be like if I wasn't an artist because it's just such a gigantic part of who I am and who I've always been. A little saying that I always keep in mind when I'm making art is no risk, no magic. Art is the one place where I feel super free to take risks. The rest of my life I keep it pretty controlled and pretty anxious, but in art I really push myself to take risks and try things and not be afraid to fail and approach it fearlessly. So no risk, no magic means you're never going to get to the magic if you don't step out of your comfort zone. In my studio, I have these 10 or so bins of paper bits. These are my collage materials. And some of these paper bits I created five years ago when I was just starting. And some of these paper bits I created yesterday. They're in no particular order. So when I'm collaging, I'm rifling through these bins and I'm just really intuitively selecting pieces. And in the end, my collages are a bit like a time capsule for me because I can usually remember where I was, which studio I was in, what was going on in my life. Was it a pandemic? Was I in my very first tiny studio? And when I look at the piece, I can kind of trace this history of my art making. I think as artists experiencing some level of success, it is absolutely vital that we uplift and encourage other artists and aspiring artists to keep making art or start making art. I don't understand gatekeeping in the art world. I just want everyone to make art that is true to them and makes them feel happy. And at the end of the day, art is not that serious and it enriches our life and teaches us about who we are. Creativity means exploring all the different possibilities in life and in art. Finding new ways to approach things, trying things, pushing limits, pushing yourself outside of your comfort zone, experimenting, and trusting your wildest ideas.